Everyone, welcome to the Body Beat Down. What's going on, guys? How's everybody doing today? Doing well, thank you for asking. Body Beat Down here on this Saturday morning. Getting a little bit of a walk going on. So, beautiful day. Be a beautiful day. So, today's plans are we're going to do something with the grandkids. Get out and do something. But before that, old grandpa's got to get his walk on. And I've not even had anything to, to eat yet, and I've been up a while. Not gonna do my big Saturday breakfast that I do normally. Not gonna do that today. I don't wanna get overly full, because uh, if we're going out of town, I'm gonna wanna eat, and I wanna be able to enjoy, and I get full too quickly, so. I want to be able to enjoy what I'm going to eat. So, anywho. We got some noise going on. Pressure washing going on. We got some kind of... Uh, some kind of a... Run going on. Some sort of marathon or something here. Like I said before, I'm in a very popular spot, and so a lot of that stuff happens through here. And as I was leaving my house, I had a bunch of runners go by. So. Let me get across this intersection. Hello, how you doing? All right. So, as far as my week, as far as my week goes, my working out it went amazing amazingly amazing of course there's videos out there you can check out and I even did a quick little recap video with my three main lifts and all that so might be easier for you to look at that if you want but I always appreciate people that watch all the videos and give me a little bit of your time if you want to So, uh, what else? So going into next week, whew, not exactly sure what I'm going to be doing. Not exactly sure. Uh, I'm, li I'm not going to be maxing out or anything next week because I did that this week. You don't want to do that every week. That's where, uh, that's where you start to get problems when you start maxing out all the time. Your body's not meant to do that. It's not meant to do that. You gotta give it a little bit of recuperating. Recuperation? I don't know. We gotta build strength, we gotta build endurance, we gotta heal up a little bit, build new muscle, 
break down that muscle, build more muscle, all that good stuff. That's the process. Trees. So, uh, today I'll get my walk done. I'll still have to hit the heavy bag and go for a little bike ride at some point this weekend. I may get to, depending on how busy we get with the grandkids today, later this evening, I might get a heavy bag session in today, so. And if I do that, then all I gotta do is get a little bike ride in tomorrow. Again, I'm trying to incorporate some new things or some things I used to do. into my daily lifestyle for better health and fitness because let's face it just lifting weights alone isn't going to do the trick health and fitness starts with your diet diet doesn't mean carrots and celery dipped in water that's not your diet your diet is your nutritional plan. Everything starts there. Trees. Trees. Look at all the trees. Beautiful trees. So we wanna make sure we're at least getting some good nutrition in the body. And as best as best of uh, some sleep and rest as you can, and then add in your training, whatever style of training you want to do, add that in, and you're good to go. You rinse and repeat. You do it every day. Just do it. You don't think about it. You just get to that point where you do it. So. Anyhow. Beautiful, beautiful day. Now we got some of the runners over there. I know you can't see them on this camera, but coming up the back side of that road there. You can hear people hollering for them. Uh, I'm not sure what the little marathon is for, if it's just for fun or if it's for some kind of benefit or something. I know at least, I know at least one of the guys out there running. He's a good guy. David Bouillon. Good guy. He's always going. Good guy, good guy. So, uh, it's been a little while since I've made some noise on the drums. Some of you might be wondering, man, where's this wonderful drum covers at? <laughs> well, I'm not burnt out. I'm just, sometimes you kind of get, sometimes you just want a break. And sometimes with that, you also, you kind of get frustrated and kind of lost with stuff sometimes. Maybe, you know, hey, what's your next step? What's the next step? I don't know. So, my next step is I should be practicing 
every day. Same thing with my working out and everything. I should be putting that much time and effort into my drums. Oh, speaking of which, with the whole YouTube copyright thing. Now, those of you that watch my channel on a regular basis, you know I'm not monetized. Number one, I don't have the qualifications to be monetized. Number two, even if I did, I'm not gonna be monetized because I don't do social media for money. I do it for my self-gratification and hopefully to leave something to my family uh, to go back and look at at some point, whether I'm dead or alive, a hundred years from now, 10 million years from now. I do it in hopes to inspire other people out there. And uh, that's pretty much it. So I'm not monetized and I never will be. But, and I've always stand firm, I always stood firm on, well, I'm going to listen to music in my videos. Well, they're starting to, it seems like they're starting to crack down even more on the whole copyright thing. And, and again, there's different types of copyrights and different things. I'll go over it again. Your standard copyright's not a big deal. You're just not going to make any money off the video. Which again, I don't care. It's just a standard copyright. And you have some copyrights or where, where you're partially blocked, partially limited to the audience. It could be my videos are not being seen in Russia or someplace like that that I really don't care. No offense to Russia or anywhere else in the world, but my main demographic is here in the States. You know, you have uh, different things like that where it's partially blocked in countries like that. Now they've gotten to the point to where it seems like a lot of it is being blocked here in the States. So, you know, if people are going to see my videos, I kind of, I, I got to kind of think about the music. So some of my videos will have just no music and some of them might just have some random free to use copyright free you know uh, free to use crap music that's not that good so we're just gonna kind of make the best of it as we can the videos the message of the videos is what counts more than you know what music I'm listening to so I gotta try to remember that. Even though I like music and I think it should be free to use, especially if you're not being monetized, especially if they're getting recognition, you know, in the descriptions and they're, you know, how YouTube goes ahead and puts all the music information in there a lot of times. They're getting free pub publicity no matter what, they're still getting recognized by people that know them and then people that don't know them so anyway it's just a bunch of crud and i touched on that last weekend so anyway we're pushing through we're putting out more videos we're doing a few different things along the way yesterday i did some burpees and I did some, I'll call them granddaughter squats, where I had my oldest granddaughter up over my shoulders and squatting with her. Did a couple sets of those. You know, just trying to incorporate some different things and have a little bit of fun. And that's what fitness needs to be about, is fun. Because when you take the fun out of it, well, it not only gets boring, but people get burnt out on it. People like to have fun. And I've always been about having fun. Even though sometimes our daily lives that we go through and sometimes people in, in our lives and sometimes people online like to suck our, or try to suck our joy out of us. You know, we can't let that happen. We gotta stand strong to who we are, keep pushing on and uh, be ourselves and enjoy life.
It's good to see a lot of people out doing stuff. Good to see people out doing things. I'm going to go ahead and cut across here. Stay out the way. <sighs> Beautiful day, guys. So, uh, we're going to have a Halloween party at our house on the 26th. Uh, we've done this a couple years back. We had a really good time. We had a big turnout and people dressed up and we had games and giveaways and all kind of good stuff. And had a good time. Lots of food. Lots of hanging out and just having a good time. So we're doing that again this October. And on Halloween, this road is one of the busiest roads in town. Uh, and also there's another couple of sections that get really busy, but this is a really busy road. And uh, this is our second Halloween here. And uh, last Halloween, we had a good turnout. And they had a lot of people enjoyed coming to our house because uh, I was dressed up as Michael Myers and was kind of stalking people out there. And, having a good time and those people talking about it online in our local groups here in town and all that good stuff so I told them you know be prepared for next year which is this year and uh, we're gonna do it again and maybe have another maybe get one of my other sons out there to help me spook some people and have some fun I'm gonna set up the projector and have some movies playing or some music or something you know try to spice it up a little bit so anyway we're looking forward to all that <coughs> well I am home I see my home my bus so that means that I'm home guys if I give you a little inspiration to have a little fun to do a little better for yourself health wise inside and out uh, maybe like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff to the Body Beatdown. That's me, Michael, your amazing host. And don't forget, get up, get out, get rad, do it to it, and we'll see you next time on the Body Beatdown. See y'all later. Have a good day. Get up, get out, get rad, and do it to it.